Welcome into the channel. If this is your first time here, I appreciate you taking time out of your day to watch the video. And if you do enjoy it, please consider subscribing to the channel, turning on the bell notification. That's, now that that's out of the way, did you just buy your new Sony A80J OLED and you want to enjoy beautiful 4K resolution gaming, 120 hertz, VRR, but you're not sure how to do that? Let me hop right in, in here and show you. So first things first, you'll want to do it at the console level. So we will hop out of here, go into settings, go down to screen and video. And under video output, you want to have this set to automatic. And I chose to turn on apply to unsupported games. That's up to you. Uh, if you feel like you would want to have that activated. And also for your 120 Hertz output, I have mine set to one uh, to automatic. And that way uh, at the game level, if the game offers that particular that particular frame rate, then you'll have it automatically activated or in the game level, you can go in and, and manually change it to off if you want. So we'll back out of here, back into the game. And the next step will be at the TV level. So go to your settings, channels and inputs, scroll down to external inputs, Go down to HDMI signal format, and I have the PlayStation 5 connected to HDMI 4. Uh, HDMI 3 or 4 will do this, but I have it on 4. And as you can see, there are four choices over there. Standard, Enhanced, enha enhanced Dolby Vision, and Enhanced VRR, essentially. Uh, I believe when the TV, uh, the first time you turn it on, I believe it will be in standard format for all of these inputs. So you will have to go in here and manually change them depending on what's connected. But as you can see here, I do have that on the VRR selection. That way, if the game supports variable refresh rate, now the, now the game will be able to play in that format. And like I mentioned a moment ago, let's back out of here. It is dependent on the game itself. So let's go into settings, graphics. As you can see, if you're looking for 120 hertz, uh, you go in here and toggle this on and then make the rest of the changes based on uh, what works best for you. But that's all I had for you today. So again, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next one.